Welcome to ManyOrange. ManyOrange provides single sign-on solutions for Jira and as we know that it is the best OAuth and OpenID SSO solution available in the market. So, in this video, we are going to set up Jira single sign-on with custom OpenID provider. Let's get started with the setup. On the Jira dashboard, navigate to settings icon on the top right corner and click on manage apps. In the find new apps section, search for OAuth SSO in the search bar. Click on the free trial in the ManyOrange plugin. Click on accept and install to agree with ManyOrange policies and terms of use. After successful installation, use the license key to activate the plugin. After activation of the license key, click on ManyOrange OAuth client. In the configure OAuth tab, we will be covering custom OpenID app as an OAuth provider. Here, you can go through the setup guide. You will get step-by-step -step instructions. Let's configure ManyOrange's custom OpenID provider. You can use any other OpenID provider. Log into your ManyOrange account. Then, navigate to Apps, and click on Manage Apps. Here, we will be using Jira as our OAuth client. Here, enter the client name of your choice. For redirect URL, go back to the plugin and copy the callback URL and paste it in the given field. In the Add Policy section, let the group name be default, policy name is Jira Policy, and login method is password. You can also enable two-factor authentication and adaptive authentication here. Then, click on Save. Your app has been configured successfully. Let's configure Jira as OpenID client. In the General Settings tab, let the app name be Custom Opened ID. Then, for Client ID, go to the Identity Provider. Click on Select, then click on Edit option. Here, you will find the Client ID. Copy it, and paste it in the plugin. Similarly for Client Secret, go to your IDP. Click on Reveal Client Secret. Then, copy it, and paste it in the plugin. The configuration will vary for other OpenID providers. You can refer the setup guide for the configuration. In scope section, it is mandatory to enter OpenID, but we would also include email and profile because ManyOrange provides those scope. Then, for authorize endpoint go back to the ManyOrange account and scroll down to find authorization endpoint in OAuth endpoints. Copy it, and paste it in the given field. Similarly, you will find the access token in the OAuth endpoints as token endpoint, copy and paste it in plugin. You can enter the logout URL as well, but it is optional to do so. Now, scroll down to advanced settings section, and enable the state parameter option. Then, click on save. Your OAuth settings are updated successfully. You can edit, test, and delete your application. Click on Test button, to test your configuration. Log in using your ManyOrange credentials. You can see test configuration here. Along with first name, last name and email ID. After successful test connection, you will get to see SSO button on the Jira login page now. Click on Use OAuth login button. Now, log in using your ManyOrange credentials. You will be successfully logged into Jira dashboard using ManyOrange credentials. Go to the user profile to check the user data. And you can see the user's full name and email ID here. ManyOrange provides best single sign-on solutions. Thanks for watching.